shaking. And you ain't nervous anymore. And by God, it ain't you. Wild turkey had been found in abundance throughout the eastern United States and on this land we today call Missouri. For generations, Native Americans held them in high regard and harvested them as a primary source of food and ornamentation. And this guy is going to be the one to take over the turkey hunting game. What is up? It is your boy Cooper Knuckles, a.k.a. The Poncho Man, a.k.a. The two-time donkey racing champion, a.k.a. the one-time world champion of lawnmower freestyle turkey slaying son of a gun, me. On today's video, if you have yet to realize, it is my turkey hunting debut adventure into the wilderness going after wild turkeys. We're just going to dive right into it. So first things first, when I showed up, I had to select the gun I was going to use. So here is the bit of me selecting which gun I'm going to use. So enjoy. Front bead. Okay. Okay, so you're going to have the red bead right touching the top. All right. And when you put that red bead right on that orange thing. Yep. Pull the trigger. Pull with it. God, you guys are short. Well, training is going good. I think I killed my decoy, which was an Amazon cardboard box. That is a dead bird. That's a dead bird right there. Now, right. I want you to try my red dot. Okay. It's a single shot. Okay. Okay. If it feels more comfortable to you. Okay. And you like the having the dot on it instead of the bead. Okay. Then I'll put the single shot in your hand and we'll have them sitting right there with us. I had more kick. <laughs> <laughs> I just click that. There you go, just like that. Oh. Which gun you shoot? That is another dead turk. This right here is, is number nine number nine tungsten. So it's a very, very small, it shoots like lead. Okay. Okay but it's very, very smaller and denser than lead. All right, it's pretty safe to say I'm choosing the red eye. Yes, the red eye will be a bigger gamble because it's only one shot. And, uh, but the, the, the pro to it is the red eye sight is magnificent. Nothing against Lexi's gun. It's just with the scope, you have the whole turkey in your line of vision with a red eye where you're going to shoot. With the empty barrel, um, you just, you got to hope you're there, basically. And my eyesight is not the greatest, so I'm going to go with whatever helps me the most. So now that we got that out of the way, it is time to master the turkey call. So enjoy these clips of Adam teaching me how to use a turkey call. All right. So obviously... You were already running this one. Mm hmm Sounded darn. Mm hmm But you just mainly... Well, other side works better. So, you're, that's that's a standard yell. I take this pot call here. A pot call? A pot call. That's a perk. Yeah, that sounds a lot better. Okay. Turkeys can hear very, very sensitive. So I don't need to sit here and I scream on the call. Yeah. Okay. I can simply just be like real soft. They'll, you know, do their thing. Come on in. Like a pencil. Like a pencil. Just like this. You know, hold down. Oh, there you go. I just do fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> but if you just if you just do a little slight little slight, a little bit more of an angle. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. You did it. Damn it. The best thing you can do and the best thing you can teach somebody 
is if you start talking like a hen and he responds to you, shut up. Don't overcall. Just shut up. Because the more you ignore him and he gobbles and you don't say a word, he's gonna come, he's gonna come looking. But I am not saying I'm the best, nor will I ever be the best. One of the best guys I think is the best is probably Michael Waddell. That well, is, if he sees this video, that we're is calling you out. Michael Waddell, you're the man. Challenge us. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I got my gun selected. Turkey call skills, kind of ass still. Uh, and it is time to get out into the field and go catch us a wild turkey. Got up at five in the morning to get out to that damn field. Clearly, it's only been an hour since we've been out here. We've heard a turkey, but I haven't seen it yet. And to be honest, I was about to fall asleep, and then I got a nudge on my shoulder. Turkey. You good. good job, dude. Good job, man. You <laughs> saved that show, man. That's your fucking first show. Cooper, go ahead and explain what happened this morning. Well, we were sitting in a little stand, or what is it? Ground blind. Ground blind, and uh, Adam saw a turkey. Said, Don't move. I really wanted to move. Uh, and then it got up close enough, 40 yards exact, and he gobbled at it and stopped, and I shot it in head. Now, now it's fucking dead. Now we're here. <laughs> the cows are hungry. This is an example. Don't go looking for ladies, guys. Don't go looking for ladies because this is what happens. <laughs> you simping? You're six feet under. <laughs> there you have it. The boy slayed his turkey. This is how we do it, boy. This turkey woke up in the morning, didn't understand that sitting out there in the field was the two-time donkey racing champion, one-time lawnmower freestyle champion, and now the turkey slaying Son of a gun, Cooper Knuckles, a.k.a. the poncho man, was out there waiting on him to get up there and gobble. This has been my turkey hunting video. Uh, I had a lot of fun. You can guarantee there's going to be more hunting videos in the future because I think this is my new favorite hobby. Once again, thank you to Adam and Lexi for inviting me out for an amazing birthday hunt gift. And... Uh, Hopefully to many more. Peace out. If you enjoyed, hit that like, subscribe, subscribe.
subscribe. And we'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace out, y'all. I gotta go die. What?